Hello engineers, welcome to video tutorial on how to generate box culverts drawings as per Indian standards easily using e-survey structure. By providing a few vital details related to culvert drawing, you can easily create culvert drawings to specified scale, which saves up to 90% of your time. Select road details, box details, mention FRL, number of cells, Road chainage value, reinforcement details, invert level, select downstream side and select the drawing legend template, reinforcement template and click on generate button to create box culvert drawing. E-survey structure will generate cross section drawing of box culvert, top view, side views and haunch details instantly along with reinforcement details. Having seen how easily you can generate the box culvert drawings, let us deep dive into creating box culvert drawing step by step. In this video tutorial, you will learn how to set up road type, how to define the box used in a project, how to specify parameters for various culvert components, how to define reinforcement details, how change default box culvert settings, how to create box culvert drawings in special condition, how to fit your drawings in different sheet sizes, and at the end, you will learn how to create multiple box culvert drawings at a time using the Excel import feature of eSurvey structure. Open eSurvey structure. Select new from file menu and specify your project name and click on save. Select box culvert sub menu under main menu. Step 1. How to set up road type? In the input group, you have to select road details from the drop down. The application comes with few predefined road details such as PMGSY, 2 lane, 4 lane, etc. You can select one of the defined roads from the drop down. If you want to change the property of the defined road, click on the triple dotted button and open the road defaults window and change property of already defined roads or you can create a new road details as per the project requirements. In this window, you have to mention details about median, carriageway, paved shoulder, earthen shoulder and side slope details. Step 2 how to define the box details used in the project? In the input group, you have to select box from drop down. The application has few predefined box details such as box 4M by 3M, box 7M by 5M, box 5M by 5M. You can select one of the box details from the drop down. If you want to change the property of a defined box, click on a triple dotted button and open the property details window and change the property of the already defined box or you can create a new box details as per the project requirements. In this window, you have to mention box details including haunch details and retaining wall details. Step 3. How to define the reinforcement drawing details? In the input group, you have to select reinforcement details from drop down. The application comes with few predefined reinforcements details such as box 4M by 3M, box 7M by 5M, box 5M by 5M. You can select one of the box details from the drop down. If you want to change the reinforcement property of the defined box, click on a triple dotted button and open the reinforcement details window and change the property of already defined reinforcement or you can create a new reinforcement details as per the project requirements. In this window, you have to mention various reinforcement details including SKU details. Step 4. How to specify parameters for various culvert components? Select road and box from drop-down. And you can note that carriageway camber and earthen shoulder camber will get filled automatically depending on saved road details. You can change these values as per the project requirement. You have to specify the formation level, 
number of cells and chainage at which you want to create this culvert. You have to select the reinforcement value from the drop-down. You can create a drawing of a new box culvert or for widening an existing box culvert. You select a new culvert and then specify invert level at upstream side. Also, mention whether the upstream side is on the left-hand side or right-hand side. Select a drawing sheet size from the template drop-down, enable reinforcement template and select reinforcement template and click on generate button to generate the drawing of new culvert with reinforcement details. Creating box culvert drawing is that simple. Along with the drawing, the software will create an Excel report with bar bending schedule with quantity calculation. Generated drawing file will have five views, plan and respective side view and cross section and its respective side view, haunch details and shear key details. Reinforcement drawing also gets created by the side of the main drawing. Step 5. How change default box culvert setting? When you create the box culvert drawing, many other derivatives are calculated automatically depending on the values specified in setting window. Click on the setting window, in which you can see the values of approach slab, aprons, box, parapet wall, corbel or bracket, shear key, expansion gap, and soil slope. You can make changes as per the project requirements and regenerate the drawings. By clicking on the layer button in settings window, you can change the color, layer name, hat pattern, and hat scale, and other properties related to layers of the generated drawing and other factors like font styles and dimension properties. Step 6. How to create culvert drawing with special condition? There may be a skew in the culvert. You may want to restrict the width of the culvert. You may wish to prepare a culvert drawing if you are going to retain the existing culvert. E-survey structure can meet all these requirements. Specify the angle of skew. Generate the drawing. E-survey structure creates the culvert drawing with skew. Select left and right check box next to restrict width and specify length up to which you want to restrict and click on generate drawing. You can see that the software will create culvert drawing with specified restricted lengths. If you want to retain the existing culvert, select existing culvert widening from the design dropdown. Specify the distance at which the existing culvert is present. If you give a positive value that indicates the distance from the center to right side, and a negative value suggests the distance from the center to the left side. By specifying the distance, you can create box culvert drawing in the case of an existing culvert. Step 7. How to fit your drawings in different sheet sizes? For each of the generated views, the software will create the scale text. E-survey structure allows you to prepare each view on a different scale. You can prepare the drawing in A to size template, a widely preferred drawing sheet size for generating culvert drawings. However, if you want to prepare the drawing in a different sheet size, you can configure drawing parameters in the DWG template details window. Click on the triple dotted button next to template drop down. The DWG template details window opens up, select the template name, and respective drawing position and scale details available for editing. You can change positions as per your project requirements, and you can change the X, Y position and scale of each view in this window. When you generate the drawing again by changing the required template details, e-survey structure will generate all the views considering the values saved in the respective template. There will be an associated template drawing for each drawing template as specified in DWG New Template window. You can open the DWG New Template window by clicking on the triple dotted button next to the template drop-down in the DWG Templates window. 
Select the title block drawing file in the DWG new template window by clicking on the triple dotted button next to path and saving the setting. The other solution to update the title block is to change the title block supplied with software to suit your requirement by opening the drawing file from C. eSurvey, eSurvey structure, templates. If you make a change in title block drawings same will be reflected in the newly generated drawing. You can also change the position, scale of various views and title block drawing as explained above for reinforcement drawing. Step 8. How to generate multiple drawings at a time? Until this point, you learned how to generate a single box culvert drawing. Interestingly, you can generate multiple drawings in eSurvey structure in one go by following a few steps. Click on the Bulk Generate button, select New Culvert or Existing Culvert option and click on Template button. An Excel template will open and fill in the details and save the Excel file. Click on the triple dotted button next to Import File text box in Import Excel File group and select the saved template. Click on the triple dotted button next to the path text box in export folder group and mention the folder to create all the drawings. Click on generate button to generate multiple drawings in one go. You may note that software will create all the new drawings in the specified output folder. eSurvey structure offers great flexibility while preparing box culvert drawings. E-survey structure can do much more than generating box culvert drawings. Watch other videos in this series to find out how you can generate pipe culvert drawings and many more. Thank you for watching this video. If you are working in the infrastructure industry, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We regularly add informative videos about infrastructure design and engineering solutions. Roan InfraSwit and Water InfraSwit are very popular software solutions for infrastructure engineering. You can also book a free demonstration of the software by visiting www.esurveying.net. You may reach us through email at info at esurveying.net. You can call us on plus 919-449-599709. Or book online demonstration through our website www.esurveying.net.